So, in my craft room. That's why there's all this mess. And, hello, we're about to open, yeah, some more vlog boxes. Um, you saw a lot of the other birds in the first vlog box video. So, today I have brought in this grumpy boy who is kind of camera shy. Oh, there we go. Say hi. No? Okay. If you did not watch the last uh, flock box unboxing video, highly suggest you do so because um, the boxes are incredible and I am just super impressed. Um, I am here to tell you, uh, so these boxes are delivered every month and that seems like that's going to be exactly what I need because they've already gone to town on some of the other toys um, where there's just, there's nothing left. Now this one, um, he's not a huge fan of toys. Yeah, you hissing. He's not a huge fan of anything, in fact. <laughs> yeah, but we'll see. Maybe some of these will, every once in a while, he'll like put one, I think it's mostly to throw a tantrum and like let me know he's pissy, but um, uh -huh. but every once in a while he will grab a toy and like shake it all around and destroy it. So this time, let's see. We're gonna start with the little one. So the flock box is a monthly subscription box for birds. It has different toys in it for them. <gasps> oh my God. It's, this is the stuff that I might edit out because it seems so ridiculous. I'm so excited. <gasps> It's Halloween themed. This is so, so, so cute. And now their cages can be Halloween. I love it. And so the pumpkins are stuffed. I'll have all the links below, like last time, to um, look at the company and look at their options if you are interested in getting any of these or even sending these to bird owners or other bird rescues or anything i can tell you anyone with a bird needs more toys uh, so this one and um toilet paper tubes are like a favorite actually a lot of my pets love playing with toilet paper even some of the dogs it's very strange so you have a tube and it's stuffed with more things which is excellent and lots of little wood pieces oh this though he might like actually because the last one with the little thingies on it <laughs> whatever they are he was obsessed with. I can tell you want to, but you don't want me to know. You don't want to give me the satisfaction of knowing that I've made you happy because you're independent. <laughs> Here's another one that looks like Halloween, kind of. Is it a wiffle ball? Did we ever figure that out? Uh, stuffed full of things. I should show you guys the toys from last month <laughs> so you understand how much they love them. So, little plastic toy filled with lots of little papers. Moving on to the medium size. Animal holics, fiddle focus. Da, 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 da. Here's this one. These are so big. So and this one's heavy. Look at all these wooden things. It'll be demolished. And then these rings that they loved last time. Oh my goodness. So you have four tendrils. And these last a long time because these are big wood pieces and it does last i mean i'm just at the point i noticed today i'm about at the point where i need to replace the toys from last month so they lasted the large box look at how exciting this is if you were a bird would you not be just like overwhelmed by this new toy Toys like this are like the gift that keeps on giving because they'll pull it all out and then I'll come behind them and stuff it all back in and they have a whole nother day's worth of fun things to do. So you got the coconut piece and then all the natural twine. Oh, and look, oh, that's so cute. I didn't even see these. Yeah, uh, inside them are the, these little bricks. And like this one, look at this little duck. And then, this one's definitely going in the aviary with those little, Chewing monsters. This fungus. This toy is basically as big as me. So, four of these long assorted 
chains that have, oh, you're doing my hair back there? Yeah, thank you, it's beautiful. So you've got all different wood pieces, different colored wood pieces, different sizes, and then mixed in is the cardboard. I find that mine always go for these thin pieces of wood first, because they can like, it's amazing what their beaks do if you ever watch them. They can peel off like the tiniest, most specific piece. Because you think about it when they're eating like seeds and things, they'll pull off just this tiniest little piece of skin from a grape or yeah, like the shell of a seed. That's the other big one. Now, I will take you all around. Once my camera charges a little bit. Uh, I'll take you all around and show you the birds getting in your toys. Thank you for your assistance and for not pecking my eyeball out on camera. This is an example. Um, this is what's left of last month's toy. So I would say that was a big hit. I also, I just love how it looks, like being able to hang all of these toys all over the place in here. It looks so fun. You get fun? Yeah. All right. <laughs> Look at that. You are a toy fanatic. What do you think of the pumpkin? What do you think of that pumpkin? Do you like it? Would you like a pumpkin toy for Halloween? Huh? Would you like this? going oh my goodness so he just watched me give the um yeah he watched me give the cockatoos their toys which right now they don't care about but by tomorrow they'll be <laughs> they'll be destroyed he was freaking out now i know never give him his toys last yeah we're so concerned we weren't gonna get him huh we love toys huh you and Frankie. That's my ring. That's not a toy. You and Frankie love toys. He's so cute. This is what's left of this. He's already taken it off of that toy. And, uh, yeah, I have a feeling it's about to disappear entirely. Worth it. Public service announcement. Don't get a bird if you're going to keep it in a cage. None of my birds are locked in their cages. Most of them have huge aviaries. <laughs> Most of them, <laughs> you look terrifying, huge aviaries also, so they can be indoor, outdoor. I have like 10 perches throughout my house. I know I say this in almost every bird video, but it's really, really important, okay, to have a happy, healthy bird. They're not meant to be kept in a cage all the time. That is all.